Hey guys, Brian here, and on today's video, we're going to be talking about managing stress. About 30% of college students reported that stress had negatively affected either an exam grade or a course grade, an increase of 5% since a 2010 survey. Some of the methods used for stress management that we'll be talking about today include diet and exercise, sleeping patterns, and taking control of your personal lifestyle. Our first example here is exercise. Wow, look at that guy go. I wonder who he is. Oh, anyways, an easy exercise you can implement into your day to day basis is running. Not only will running keep you in killer shape and help your blood flow and your heart rate, but it will also help produce hormones called beta endorphins. These natural narcotics cause feelings of good contentment, happiness, and help manage anxiety and depression. Our next topic is healthy dieting. Although it is okay to eat your favorite foods every once in a while, it is very important to keep a balance between what's healthy and what's not. A healthy snack you can consider can be a high in protein and healthy fat peanut butter and jelly sandwich. You want to stay away from chips and other candies and instead eat a fruit. Whatever you do, stay away from caffeine. It is bad for you and it will only get you more tired. The next topic I will talk about is managing a sleeping schedule. A lack of sleep can lead to anxiety, depression, and academic struggles. That's why it is important to avoid long daytime naps, get exercise during the day, and set a regular schedule for going to bed and getting up. The last topic we will talk about is taking control of your lifestyle. If you have trouble with parts of your day, such as preparing for a test or being on time, it is important to modify your schedule in order to become more prepared and less stressed. And that concludes the video. Thanks for watching.